Hello everyone and welcome to a little Christmas episode. Today on my channel it's going to be a bit more relaxed, a bit more calm, a bit more focused on, on talking about really important things um, other than only Planet Zoo. Uh, in the background you will see now a bit of a time lapse of me building a wonderful little chapel and at the end uh, I will switch then over to a cinematic where we are talking over the scene uh, which looks pretty relaxed a little chapel in Yosemite Valley uh, while it's snowing and you know having a little bit of a Christmas vibe going on. I didn't want to focus on on talking about my build today as I do usually. I wanted to take the time to yeah get 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 a little bit uh, out there with a bit more of an emotional video which is not you know not too much emotional about me, but just about the situation, about doing YouTube, about um, the change that has happened in the last couple of months and yeah, just taking the opportunity to, to talk to you guys and uh, giving you a warm thank you at this point uh, for all the support you've been giving the channel, uh, me personally obviously, in the last couple of months and um, yeah, just, just in general how this all has, has kind of turned out to be very this, this, this very element of my life that I totally do enjoy uh, doing each and every day. Um, I think the couple last, I think, two and a half months, I was able to bring out an episode each and every day, which in itself is already pretty incredible considering that I have a daily job, um, 40 hours a, long, uh, a week and, you know, a social life. I, I do my football, um, go to practice, I, I spend time with my wife and, you know, all that kind of stuff. Um, that keeps happening, obviously, <laughs> um, and, and still uh, I spend the nights and some time doing these videos uh, because I just feel like it's um, it's not only for me like a little creative outlet, it's also something uh, that I do want to bring to you guys. I, I see all the positive comments, I see, see all the discussions going on. My Discord is getting more and more active, uh, the live streams are super amazing, it's always fun to just get in touch with you guys and basically sharing a passion whether it has been planet coaster for the past couple of years now it has been planet zoo but i feel almost like it has evolved of you know from a single game uh, towards being more like really a community thing and this is what i really want to focus on uh, doing more next year being more involved more uh, even more together with you guys as a community uh, being more um active in the interaction and trying to bring this all together a bit more um, as it already is so yeah just focusing on that I really have to say that I feel still very much um, overwhelmed by all the things we do I mean you see me talking about numbers and views every now and then and, and in the comments or whatnot um, because it it just is a part of YouTube um, and whoever is going to say something else is just pretty much lying because you, you are a human being and as a human being um, you obviously see the numbers and see the views and you obviously do comparisons because otherwise you, you wouldn't just survive. Um, it, it's a human drive to do that and that's totally normal. But the most important thing is uh, to always focus on the bright side of things and um, to focus on, on what really is the major result of, of me doing YouTube, for example. And there's this, um, you know, I, I just become friends with so many awesome people in the community, especially this year, 2019 was super awesome. Um, uh, you know, Gamescom brought us together with a lot of new people. Um, the crew just kind of grew, um, thanks to Frontier, obviously. Um, they brought us all there to, to the Gamescom. It was a wonderful week of, of nerdism and, and being just there, having fun with all the people, sharing the same passion and, and meeting some of you guys as well and just having having a wonderful time was just a purely great experience and um, yeah I just want to thank every one of those people I, I just got to know there whether it be Arcus, um, Best in Slot I met there for the first time, a Bazo stream obviously, hello it's Colo, so all these amazing people, uh, Mr. Randhammer as well uh, having some wonderful uh, sarcasm uh, based uh, discussions in the evenings and, and having a laugh and yeah obviously the evergreens um, being a sylph lady, a beau, Shantae and all the great people, uh, Matthew Frollins from Frontier and all the other great guys um, you know th there are so many cool people around and it, it was such a pleasure again to, to share this and you know at the end of the day I am just a weird person sitting on the other side of the screen right now recording um, a voiceover on a video that goes publicly into into the ocean of of YouTube and potentially some small fishes are going to swim by and and get it as a little treat and 
again, it is just such a overwhelming feeling to see over 30,000 people following me on a channel doing what I love to do. It's, it's just weird. And, you know, at this point in time, you really have to kind of try to not look at what is right or left to you. Like, obviously, yes, other people are like 300,000, 3 million, 30 million, hell, even 100 million. But at the end of the day, I don't really, you know, I, I've been, let me put it that way. I've been to a football match uh, two weeks ago between uh, Bayer Leverkusen and Juventus Turin, um, which was a great Champions League evening, even though, well, it was not that great of a match. But anyways, um, and the stadium capacity of Leverkusen is 28,000 people. It was sold out that evening. Um, and then I just realized <laughs> that it, it kind of, um, there were even 5,000 people missing on, on the amount of people that follow me on this channel doing that stuff. And, and realizing this was such an awkward but yet great moment. It's, I don't know, it's just such a, such a weird situation that you realize this is real. It's it's not like it's not like a number, you know. It's it's real people that keep following this channel and keep watching the stuff and keep interacting. It's not a bot. It's it's not what people say. Hey, you're living in this online world. You know, it's the, it's the real world. It's just because people don't really gasp what this this world is about. But um, we we have in our world we've got so many great opportunities. Even though that some countries and some decisions and the politics try to uh, get rid of this insane achievement that humanity has has kind of especially in in the let's say western world unfortunately i would love to say the whole world but especially the western world um ha has gotten to and i i feel very sad when i think about what's going on in the world right now um not talking of me me personally i'm, I'm having a great time but um it kind of keeps me always um busy to to think about that not everyone is having this kind of great life and you know i i know it's a change of tone from from being very optimistic and very happy about what i did and what i do here on youtube i really have to find the words as well for those people who are not doing great and um i got a lot of messages recently of people who are not doing great but they do enjoy the videos because these videos make them feel better and here's me now saying that this is even the best part of of me doing that you know it's really hard to believe that there are other people out out there watching your videos, but it's even harder to believe that you help people and you make people happy with it. And this kind of this this knowledge that other people having a great time due to that is is just one of the best feelings you can have because when you begin with all that kind of stuff, it's so kind of fun. You don't know where this develops. You don't know what happens, but you you start realizing how privileged you are after a while and um, it's unfortunate that not everyone can be that way and every single bit I can I can do with my videos to help some of you guys uh, out of you know a bad time or helping through a bad time making you happy in the evening to watch a video making you happy to um, see your favorite stuff done on YouTube I don't know there are so many things that I could list now but you, I think you get the point and I would love to be able to do even more in the future if I if I have the chance to if I keep growing and I you know I have some more financial power so to say uh, I would love to do some more stuff even to help the people and yeah if I look now what is going on in the world uh, world like you know you name it but uh, certain presidents of certain countries um, leading their country in a very well, let's say questionable future, at least. I don't want to judge it too much because, you know, different point of views and stuff are, are always valid. But I feel like um, the achievement I just named a few minutes ago um, of, of our world being that open and, you know, I mean, hell, uh, if I look into my YouTube statistics, it's insane how many people come from so many different countries and like all over the world there seems to be no limitation anymore we we you know in my live streams i keep asking where you guys from and then like you can basically display every single time of the day during the stream because people are from all over the world and some being in the morning some being in the evening some being in the middle of the night and it's just it, it kind of connects all of you um and i feel personally attacked if if decisions of uh, countries or you know leaderships i should say um yeah threaten this because um it's been it's been a pleasure always for example to visit people in the uk uh, or to go to the united states and stuff but uh, it feels more and more weird that these countries um, are heading into a direction that might be not 
the best. I mean, I cannot judge it yet. Maybe it's the best for them, but I really feel personally we have to talk about that as well in, in kind of a video like that because I want to live in a free world. I want to have our world out there when I, when I you know, leave the, leave the flat and open the door to, to go outside. I want to feel as free as I can do here on YouTube. And um, I can't because the world is changing dramatically, unfortunately, and people are not really seeing um, the signs of the time and well they, they do but I, I feel like they they are kind of uh, finding the wrong conclusions but that's just my personal opinion here um, I just hope that the future will hopefully tie us all together a bit more especially here in Europe um, because from 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 what I learned in my history classes in school and and still being very very much into history I feel like we're repeating history unfortunately and it's not a good it's not good to do that it's really not good as a German I think I have the uh, I have to quite the, the history to, to say that. Um, I, I think I'm allowed to say that history is, repeating history is not a good idea. Now, I really want to focus on, on the good side of things, but yeah, unfortunately, humanity in its core is not good. So uh, it's great that we have a spot here where we can be good to each other and, and we can be good about that. So let's end now this, it is more like heavy part of this video because I just wanted to talk about that I feel... I have to talk about that. I don't want to, you know, I don't want to be awfully political or, you know, about this in, in my videos in general, but at the, at the time of day, at the time of uh, the month and time of the year, as we have today, Christmas Eve, I feel like I have to talk about that because Christmas is all about that, sharing love, sharing, sharing, you know, time with your beloved ones, whether it be family, your friends, uh, your, your partner. Um, I'm... In general, a person I hate, I hate days like Valentine's Day or something because I really don't need a day to tell my wife that I love her. I don't need a day to tell people that I love them. I really don't need that because you should need those days too. You should do that whenever you feel like um, because every single bit helps them out um, feeling better about themselves, about the love. Feeling, feeling beloved is the best feeling ever. No one can doubt that and um, it, I, I really hope that you guys are feeling beloved by someone and if not let me give you the love to you for tonight um i really do appreciate every single one of you watching my videos here uh whether you're a 12 years old girl from hawaii or you're a 60 years old man um from i don't know northern uh, italy i i really do appreciate every single one of you and I'm, I'm just so happy to share uh, all this kind of stuff with you guys. But again, back to the fact that this day, uh, Christmas Eve, is there to share moments with your life and uh, lo loved ones. And I really feel if you guys are watching this video today, um, it might be something you wanted to have for tonight to feel good. And I really hope I could give it to you um, with this little video giving a few um, yeah, words, words, words that hopefully matter to you for this Christmas day. I will uh, end this video now um, and I really do hope that you appreciate this little, I don't know, Christmas speech, if you will. I just wanted to end this uh, whole Christmas calendar thing, what I try to do for you also as a little treat um, and also the Christmas time with this video because the next couple of days I obviously will be stepping away a little bit from YouTube. I will do... Um, I, I will do what I have to do and what everyone should do. I will step away a little bit and focus on my family and my friends, on on my on my wife, and and just have a good time Christmas spending these days. And finally, do not stress myself. And I really would say and suggest the same to you. Please don't stress yourself. Just enjoy the days and yeah, be happy as the music uh, suggests us to be now. What a wonderful ending with this song. Now a merry merry Christmas to all of you. I really hope you appreciate 2019 until today uh, at my channel. I really hope you will stick with me. I really hope you will uh, have a wonderful time now. And yeah, guys, turn off the computer now, go downstairs, drink a hot chocolate, listen to some Christmas music and have a great time. I'll see you after Christmas just before we switch into 2020. And until then, have a wonderful time and Merry Merry Christmas.